That's a great shout out to EcoFrost Solar Solution for sponsoring the June Extreme Boating videos. You can find them in Rich's Bay, link in the description. Welcome to Extreme Boating, recorded here in St. Lucia Estuary Beaches by Beatrice Vivius. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, it's Beatrice Vivius with your Extreme Boating video. Frankie Two Socks is here today. We must start thinking on collaboration videos between me and him. Pardet is at home. Sorry guys, in this cold I just can't do all the walking. So I'm catching lifts. Let's have a look what the boats are doing. Stella lying there in the going down the channel. I think I've got enough light for Stella to make a video today. Looks like it. Looks like we're gonna get a video of Stella today. We need to foot Yelkat with two 154 stroke Suzuki's on. 23 inch counter rotating props. Reset myself, pivot around the monopod. in front of him just a few foamies the rose bowl is acting up but he's got the gap well done Stella happy hunting enjoy the day Stella's there right in the sunrise where we've seen the birds frolicking doesn't look like they've taken out their rot yet wave tons are coming down the channel it looks like Leon is the skipper today. Yep, there's Baron standing on the beach. on the power there on Wave Dancer running nicely down the channel. Just can't get my my footing right. Now Leon is waiting to see what the Rose Bowl is doing. It's a narrow channel that the guys has to come down up to Rose Bowl. There's not much room to to maneuver the rapids is quite big look at wave dancer plowing through them that is pushing in Leon is making a run for Rose Bowl big one standing up on his shoulder he's gonna have to turn north but not for far that's it well done Leon experience showed right there happy hunting enjoy the day uh, 
I don't need to say it like a pro because he's one of the pros. The Ocean Hunter is floating down the channel, one motor trimmed down. High perfectivity uh, at the launch site today. That motor doesn't want to trim down. It's trimming down now. Ah, oh, shit, I almost fell off the dune. Mission Hunter still coming down the channel while I was re-sizing my dune here. <laughs> Making sure I didn't fall off, fall off the dune if I start pivoting. He is assessing rose pole, making sure that he gets his line down the channel right. It's not an easy launch today, but if the skippers take the time, they can work it out and they can go nicely down the channel without any hiccups and reach rose bowl and the back line without any problems. But there's some huge wave standing up right there in the Rose Bowl today. South wind has blow, blown the clean water right past Ingwe Beach, I can see this morning. Correct myself, Mons with Asterix arriving. Yeah, I know, Putty has got his line right, and now that I'm here on the high ground, I can see the line that Leon and Stella took, Wave Dancer and Stella took. It makes sense. You can wait it out there so that Rose Bowl can calm down a little bit. Look at those huge waves coming through Rose Bowl there this morning. And Porti has got the boat in reverse, he's holding it steady. I'm going to use the opportunity to realign myself. Right, now I'm using auto tracking. Let's see how the cannon handle the auto, auto tracking. This ball is acting up in front of Putty. He's now got to find the gap or turn around and come back. He's at that point of almost no return. Yo, this auto tracking is excellent. Look at that big wave standing up and Ocean Hunter is in focus the whole time. Well done, Cannon. You've got this one sorted out. And Rose Bowl is flattening up. 
just that one that's standing up and then it's a gap for putty nope there's another big one standing up yes that's huge that is absolutely huge look at that Whoa. oh my goodness but after that one there's a gap if you can just push through that for me yep it opened up in front of him and there put is on the power oh no that big one oh no oh no rose bowl And auto tracking failed me there. <laughs> it jumped to the wave. We're learning. Put is coming back into the channel, making sure that he can realign himself for Rose Bowl. It's going to take about five minutes for Rose Bowl to calm down. back on auto tracking we want to see what, how it, do, it does what advantages it's got And Pot is going for it. I think he found his gap. Ah, those bowlers acting up in front of him again. Look at that massive wave. He's going to get in front of it. He got in front of it. Well done, Potty. Well done. Just a quick shout out to our sponsors. Guys, the videos, uh, extreme baiting videos, will continue after this insert. Please stay on the line. Keep watching. Ecofrost Solar Solution. Based in Rich's Bay. Look at the quality of the work. Yes, I know they pay me to say that, but look at that. Look. You can find the link in the description, the telephone number, you can get some quotes. You can find them on Google and check out the reviews. They most mainly got five star reviews. Just look at that. Look how tidy this man's work is. Go Hannes. Now, get a quote if you're in the area. Once again, thank you EcoFrost Solar Solutions for sponsoring this month's extreme boating videos. Wizard and Asterix getting ready to be pushed. Looks like Wizard is going to be first. Yes, Dylan is helping Wiseman there to get the push pole hooked up still in a very willing and able deck end as well if somebody needs a deck end and he helps in the morning here in the cold to get the boats hooked up well done Dylan thank you very much that's a push for wizard wizard being pushed by wiseman
Because it is floating, Wiseman is coming back for Asterix. Mans is checking it, that everything is tied down in the back of the boat. The drain plug is in. That's Baron and Mans talking to each other there. Young wizard skipper today. It'll be interesting to see what he does with Rose Bowl. Rose Bowl is right, right now it's very flat. And he saw his gap. And he's going for it. Yo, that's a nice launch. Well done, young man. Well done. It's just like 10 minutes after Ocean Hunter and there's just no ocean left. It's amazing how this sets work. Well done, wizard. Happy hunting. Enjoy the well, my attention was somewhere else. Mons is coming down the channel already. I missed that push. To have my line right, not to pivot so much. Mons is um, going slowly towards Rose Bowl. Quite a confident skipper, he's done this many times, but he's gonna turn around. Oh, he's running shallow there to turn around. Coming back to line up in the channel again. That's what the Rose Bowl guys missed. Just turning around, coming back into the channel, realigning yourself. But then there was 34 boats that had to get out of here as quickly as possible. flat in front of Mons. If he can get through that, then he might get through Rose Bowl before Rose Bowl stands up again. Huge one on his shoulder, look at that. But he can get in front of it quite comfortably. Nope, he can't. Look at that, look at that. He has to run north. And he got in front of it. Well done Mons, happy hunting. Enjoy the day. To reset my stance quickly so that I don't get so much camera shake and dugout is going towards Rose Bowl and he has to get through 
those ugly ones and then the rose bowl is right op opened up right in front of him and he's pushing hard to get the, through the gap and he's done it well done dugout without printing us a thumbnail um, lost your footage on the fifth um, I'm sorry I don't know what went wrong but the editing software doesn't want to pick up on it anymore and he's turned south to get in front of that one and now he's done it happy hunting guys enjoy the day and that's Robert E. Lee being pushed there by Wiseman Floating nicely and it's Dion's maiden voyage on Robert E. Lee. I believe he now works for the company. Apparently they bought out Baba Zonke and it's being refitted and refurbished. I wonder what Dion says with this easy operation that he, they have got going here. The channel is very narrow for, Baba, for Robert E. Lee to come down. But Dion lined it up nicely. With Baba Zonke it was a struggle getting the boat off, getting the boat in the water. And now he's working for a company where everything is work going smoothly. The very advantage. I think this is a blessing for Dion. In our 50s we don't want to suckle anymore. That is for the young people. We want to get up, have our coffee and do our work. with as little fuss as possible Rose Bowl is acting up for Dion right now he has to wait it, wait it out but he's in a very comfortable position in the channel just a couple of ugly rapids coming towards him he's dialing himself in on the Robert E. Lee's capabilities with the two 175s he's used to two 200s on Baba Zonke which is pretty much the same boat hull design age weight Yo, look at that ugliness there in the Rose Bowl now a couple of minutes ago there was just nothing there And again, Robert E. Lee is now... Oh, nope, Rose Bowl is still acting up, but after that one it might just open up. But Leo, Dion is forced to turn away from it. And hopefully when he turns around now, he'll be able to line up. Oh, he's going to wait a little bit more on the channel. And that's the launch. Well done, Dion. Wow, experience showed right there. Well done. Happy hunting. Enjoy the day. Hi, guys. You can really help sustain me and Pardetti and St. Lucia by just subscribing to the YouTube channel. It's absolutely for free. Click on the photo of me and Pardet and you will be subscribed.